Hello everyone, thanks for joining me today. Welcome to Miss Nene's Art. I'm Miss Nene and thank you so much for being here. If you are new here, thank you for being here as well. I appreciate you and I appreciate your time. So today I have a 12 by 36 canvas sitting in front of me. I am going to be doing somewhat of a galaxy, planetary, alien type painting. <laughs> um, I'm going to be using my favorite colors, Deco Art, Enchanted Paints. I have magenta here and I have blue. I'm going to be using the gold and the gold holographic all on a black background. I said it before and I'll say it again and I'm going to always say it because it's true. <laughs> they work better on a black background. I've tried white, never worked, never developed. Um, I've never tried blue. But I suspect that if you use a dark blue, that it would probably work as well. But I'm going to use black because black looks a lot better with these colors. So I'm going to go ahead, prep, and I will be back. Thanks for being here, guys. What I really love about this paint is that all the colors, they will develop into a really beautiful, rich blue, rich magenta, rich gold. Um, but when you pour it, it's just, they're, they're all kind of a creamy white color. But as you can see, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but you can already see around the edges where the paint is, where the, um, the deco art paint is touched, the black paint is already starting to develop. It's a really, really beautiful paint. I love these paints. That's why I always use them. Okay, so everything is dry. 
turned out really pretty. You can see some of the sparkle over in here. I don't know if you can see it, but it's there. But what I'm going to do now, because I'm not finished, I got these embroidery rings. I'm going to place them. I'm going to place this one here. And this one here. And that one there. Just let me move this one up. And let's see, maybe over here. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna paint over this, but I'm gonna still have some colors in there. So for the next step, I'm going to use the Deco Art again, Enchanted Paints, but I'm gonna use the Shimmer Violet along with the regular Enchanted Violet with no shimmer. So I'm going to mix these two together. I'm going to use the Enchanted Blue Shimmer. And I'm going to add the, um, hollow, the Holographic Illusions Deco Art Silver. So I'm going to add those. And I might, no, that's, you know, okay, I don't have any more gold. I was going to say I was going to add some gold, but I ran out. And I have a little bit of the Enchanted Shimmer Magenta, so I may just throw that in there too. So, let me go ahead and mix these paints and I'll be right back.
Oh my God. You see what I just did there, right? Wasn't paying attention, had my dryer, my hair dryer, pointed in the direction of these rings. And this, these little wooden rings are really light and I blew it right across the darn canvas. Man, if you could have heard the things I was saying out loud, that's why I'm doing a voiceover. You didn't need to hear that. <laughs> but, you know, uh, I'm gonna have to do a lot of touching up when this painting is completed. I mean, I really like using these rings. They give it a really unique look. Um, but I wish they weren't so light. If it was a little bit heavier, I gotta figure out a way to be able to get these to stay in, stay put and or not leak underneath. Uh, I haven't mastered that part yet. I only recently started doing this technique when I saw, who did I see do this? Um, Olga Sobi, I believe it was her. I believe it was her. Yes, she inspired me to try these little um, embroidery rings and she does it perfectly. Um, I'm still trying to get the hang of it, but it's gonna take some touching up after I'm done. So it's dry and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna start fixing these little areas that I screwed up, but I'm going to take care of that now. So um, just takes a little bit of um, tweaking to get them perfect again. So, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and let this dry. I'm probably gonna um, touch it up a little bit more off camera. And then in a few days, maybe a week, I'm gonna go ahead and varnish this. And then I'm gonna show you the final, final result. But for you, it's only gonna be a few seconds. So stay tuned. Hey guys, I'm back and here it is. I have to say I'm really happy with how this turned out. I love how it looks. It reminds me of an alien um, galaxy with all the different, unique, colorful, weird pattern planets surrounding in this deep 
colorful galaxy. I love how this turned out. I love, I, I used a light varnish. I didn't want it to be too shiny, but I wanted it to be just right. And I think I think I nailed it. Let me know what you think about how this turned out in the um, comments below. I love to read your feedback. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for being here. And I will catch you in the next video. Stay safe. Bye-bye.